From Piers Morgan to Love Island, a few of our favourite shows made it onto the nominee card. Will they get the win? The 2021 National Television Awards is here in an hour. First, it's a matter of talent and whether you have what the judges are after to make the big deal. to the big deal. This is the talent show that flips the script and gives the performers the power to decide their own fate. Where one winner will walk away with a staggering 50,000 euros. Each act has a huge decision to make. They can take a money deal and walk away for good, or they can turn down the deal and take their chances with the votes. <laughs> Observing all of this drama from the VIP front row, please welcome the Big Deal judges. <laughs> She's a national treasure and one funny dame. It's Deirdre O'Kane. <laughs> He's a JLS chart topper and a Strictly star. It's Aston Marigold. The queen of avant-garde, Lyra. They bounced into our lives over a decade ago and it's been jepic ever since. It's Jedward. And the icon, Boy George. George, how is the chemistry going on the judging panel? Are you all getting along? I thought Lyra was quiet until I really got to know her. Oh, she's wild. Dear Jack, what have you thought of the talent so far? I think it's been really high, and I'm worried that maybe we've put too many people through, but it's a nice worry to have. Aston, do you think it's tough for the acts to take a chance or to take the money? I think it's quite an easy decision for them if they really do believe in themselves. Lyra, have you been surprised by some of the acts' decisions? I'm surprised that uh, more people haven't taken the money like I would have taken the money and legged it out of here. John and Edward, how does it feel to be on the other side of the panel? Oh, it feels incredible. Simon Cowell is nowhere near in sight. It's a safe zone. We have yeah. actual experts on the panel who people... sing and have been on stage and have that stage presence. So it's great to hear all the judges' like, opinions. Can we get real? The first time we were on that stage, we were 17, and now we're nearly 30. Like, do you feel old? The judges, everybody. <laughs> so, who will be taking their chances tonight? Let's meet our first act. Hello. Nice to meet you. Tell everyone your name and where you're from. My name is Isabella Garvey and I'm from Sligo. Who have you got here with you today? Um, I've got my mum, uh, my dad and my brother Noah. Oh, lovely. And who inspires you, Izzy? Um, my dad because he works so hard and he's really brave. Are you ready to perform? Yeah. Okay, good luck. Izzy Garvey. So much fun. Will we go straight to the judges? Yeah. Aston, what do you think? You're 11. <laughs> Your connection that you have to the music, you can't teach that. That's a natural gift. And I must say, your dad must be so proud of you. I'm proud of you, so well done. So Thank you. Lyra, what did you think? I was welling up. I could get a bit emotional now. <laughs> <laughs> you, literally, your talent at such a young age and the power you have when you dance to tell a story through your body and your facial expressions is magical. It's so strange when someone dances and it makes you feel like crying. It's such a weird experience because you're 11, you shouldn't do that to a grown man, but... <laughs> to get into a zone at age 11, 
and hold that for the duration of your performance and not let it slip even for a second is beyond impressive. It was like to do an Oscar-winning performance of choreography. The passion, the emotion. Like, can we get her an Oscar? Like, yeah. yeah. So congratulations, well done. Thank you. Well, judges, it's time now to lock in your votes. Now, Izzy, you're going to need at least three yeses from the judges to make it through. However, right now, you are in control. You can take a chance on the votes or you can take some money and walk away from the competition for good. I'm offering you a cash deal of a thousand euro to leave immediately. If you take the deal, it's game over. If you turn it down, it's all about the votes. Izzy, are you going to take the deal or are you going to take a chance? I'm going to take a chance. Let's reveal the results on the tower. Austin, let's see if there are any more. A second vote from Jedward. Now you need one more to get through to the semi final. Let's see if it's there. Oh, I'm so happy for you. Aston, don't cry. Are you happy to see her going through? Honestly, you've set the benchmark for me in this competition. For me, you're the one to beat so far. Thank you. Let's hear it for Izzy Garvey. She pulled the story through everything. Her body, her eyes, her face, everything. She was amazing. When you first go on a judging panel, everyone's a little bit, like, suspicious. They don't really know what you're going to be like. I'm sitting next to the biggest diva of them all. Don't talk about Aston like that. <laughs> Aston is such a dope. Does it get bigger and better than this? It certainly does. He is really fair. When you actually opened up, I was like, OK, there's the voice. Lyra is a really refreshing energy, and she's funny. I do have to say hats off for getting off and throwing nice at your missus. Thank you. Deirdre is a very honest judge. She cares about the contestants, and she wants the best for them. I'm not sure that this is the right competition. For me personally, I think you should add some other kind of unexpected elements. George. I mean, the Jedward boys have christened him Yoda, you know, because he's got so much wisdom in him. When you normally perform, do you perform with a band? Are you used to singing on your own in an empty stage? Um, I usually sing completely a cappella. Oh, wow. I mean... That song was way too big. Like, those type of songs are very niche. I don't think I've ever met people that finish each other's sentences quite like Jed would do. It's almost like they're finishing our sentences as well. I'm just saying what actually happened. They can be quite rude. <laughs> trying to tell it like it is. I don't want to be mean. I'm going to give you criticism. They bring a sort of outrageousness and chaos to the show. I'm really sorry about that. So, you know, it's a bit of a I'm distraction, sorry. but... We all listen to the same performance. But I've got my own ears, and they're not attached to your head. So I'm able to hear what I hear. I'm glad I'm not sitting next to them, though. <laughs> Let's see who's next to take their chances on the big deal. Nice to meet you. What's your name? My name is Mr. Evan Roach. <laughs> Who's here with you? So today I have my identical twin brother, Owen. Oh. 
I have um, my mom, my dad, my brother, and then I have my two best friends from school and my aunt Assumpta as well. Oh, are you ready to perform? Yes, as ready as I'll ever be. Everybody put your hands together for Evan Roach. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. That was fantastic. Thank you so much. George, let's go straight to you. You really were kind of performing, you know, and um, there might be some sort of technical things to work on, but in terms of your engagement, you know, as a performer, that was fantastic. For 16, I was really impressed. Evan, you are well beyond your years. The tones <laughs> that you have in your voice are so soulful, so unique to you. It takes a lot of courage to leave your other twin on the side and just take it all <laughs> by yourself. Yeah. So well done. You're definitely on your way to stardom. I just say it's just the technical bits that will definitely come with experience. So keep going, man. Thank you so much. Enjoy. You really commanded that stage at 16 years of age. I think you will have a career in music. Thank you. I would say from a singer and a singing point of view is just learn how to control your voice on stage. Slide Thank into my so DMs much. anytime you want for advice or anything like that. I'm here to help Okay, you okay, you perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you. Well, judges, it's time now to lock in your votes. Judges' votes are now locked in. Are you going to take the deal or are you going to take a chance? What did the audience think? Take a chance! Take a chance! Take a chance! Take a chance! You want to take the chance. Let's reveal the results on the tower. Do we have one vote? That's pretty cool. Thank you so much. A vote from Boy George. We'll take that. Yes, indeed. Thank you so much. But that's only one vote. Yes, of course. We need two more. So have we got another vote on the tower for you? From Deirdre. Evan, you're almost there, okay? One more vote. Is there another vote on the tower for Evan? Okay. Yes, I am. Yeah, I'm delighted. I'm, I'm so happy that I did it. How are you feeling? Um, I'm upset that I'm not going to the semi-finals, but you know what? It was my decision not to take the buyout, and I, I still stand by that decision. And I really do appreciate um, your your um, constructive criticism, and I'll take everything on board. Thank you so much, guys. You're going to be amazing. You're amazing. Listen, this is just part of your journey. All of us get no's all the time. We don't tell people when we get no's. We only talk about the things that we achieve. I like the fact that you've made that decision and you're going to learn so much from that decision. Thank you so much. Good. I think this young man knows exactly where he's going and I think he will get there. Thank you. Everybody, please put your hands together for Evan Rogue so much, guys. Is to come when he knows what to do with his tongue and knows what to do with his specific voice, yeah. he'll be winning. He was fabulous. So he's 16. Yeah, he's fabulous. 16. He's gorgeous. Welcome back to the big deal. There have been a few twists and turns already tonight, so let's see if there's another plot twist on the horizon. Time to meet our next act. For the Gardner Brothers.
No, no, leave me no, away. <laughs> someone else. I'm coming. Come. I'll talk. <laughs> of course you will. Jedward, what did you think? The Gardner Brothers. Who's Michael Flatley? It's all about you. Here's the thing. For ages, we've been watching river dance, OK? And we, we know how brilliant Irish dancing can be. But it is time for it to go somewhere else. And it's you. You have arrived. You're fine. Thank you very much. Thank you. George? I love the kind of freshness, you know, the kind of casual look. It's just unpredictable. It's exciting to watch. Very good, very good. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Lyra, what did you think? I can barely see your feet at some point. I don't know if the hairstyle or looking at your feet, but I have a bloody headache. So smooth. You guys are so smooth. Thanks very much. Judges, it's now time to lock in your votes. I'm offering you a cash deal of a thousand euro to leave immediately. If you take the deal, it's game over. If you turn it down, it's all about the votes. Are you going to take the deal or are you going to take a chance? Uh, we're going to take a chance, yeah. Uh... Let's reveal the results on the tower. Aston, he was speechless. Let's see if there's anything else. Another vote from Deirdre. I just want to be part of your sunshine. Well done. I'm not really surprised. You've got five yeses on the tower, which means you're going straight through. Thanks very much. We're doing a TikTok. Us, us three, we're, do doing a, we're doing a full TikTok routine. Because Let's go that on. is, that's going to win me props. If I, if, I, if I dance with these guys, I'm getting mad props. I'm going to get your followers. Thank you. Thanks very much. Let's hear it for the Gardner Brothers. That was insane. Insane. Can you Irish dance? I can do a little bit. Ready, this is it for you. That's it. <laughs> That's it, there you go. I'll be the warm-up act to the Gardner Brothers. It's time to meet the next act. Wow, that walk. How are you? What's your name? My name's Spready Mercury. Did you say Spready Mercury? I did. Okay. Two years. What do you do for a living? I was a scientist. A um, scientist? I was, yes. But a bit of a career switch at the minute. It's quite the switch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, are you ready to perform? I am. Put your hands together for Spready Mercury. wanted to be someone more in my life. You are like a spider. Thank you. You have to chat, yeah, you must be knackered. <laughs> okay, let's go straight to the judges. Lyra, what did you think? I think you're bloody fantastic. I want to see your face. Can you take off the mask, please? Go on, Freddy! Run, Freddy! Yay! <laughs> take it off, take it off. I think everyone should have an alter ego. I love that you have an alter ego, that a person like you can do this. Um, and I agree with George, everybody should have an alter ego. It's fantastic. Can I Freddy? Yes. Yes, Freddy, cool. Or Steve. Or oh, Steve. Oh, <laughs> Spready. <laughs> Spready. He's all out now. <laughs> You didn't split your jeans, so that's congratulations. That's an achievement in its own. Because so you could have had a, 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 an Eiffel. Steve. Steve. <laughs> Judges, it's now time to lock in your votes.
The judges' votes are now locked in, but right now, you are in control. I'm going to offer you a cash deal of a thousand euro to leave immediately. Will we see what the audience think? Yep. What do you guys think? So, are you going to take the deal or are you going to take a chance? I'm going to take the deal. Whoa! Okay. Lots of thousand euro in the bank, but your journey is over. Now, before you go, let's take a look at how the judges would have actually voted. These votes no longer count, but this is how it could have gone. Lyra? Did you get any more yeses? No! What do you think of that? I mean, I was pleased with all the comments that you all said. I appreciate all the honest feedback. Don't think for a second I didn't love what you did, I did. I had a sense that you might take the money, and so I was, like, gambling, and that's what the show's about. You're like Batman up there on heels, so just keep doing it, keep the lessons coming. And who knows what we're doing. Spready, spready, Mercury. Well done, Spready. Everyone, put your hands together for Spready Mercury. Who wants to get in the poll? All right, get away, get away, get away. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. All right. That's it, that's all you're getting. <laughs> <laughs> All right, whatever, just for you guys. <laughs> for you guys. Welcome back to The Big Deal. With only a limited number of places in the semi-finals, the acts might believe in their talent, but will the judges be on the same page? Let's see who's next. Are you ready to perform? Yeah. Ready. Put your hands together for Shauna and Raphael. Are you okay? Oh, God. Yeah, Does that kind of thing normally happen? No, almost never. <laughs> okay, let's go straight to the judges. Aston. Um, that is the most terrifying thing I think I've seen in a long time. And you're okay? Yeah. Shawnee, you're all right? Okay, yeah. Um, that was very intense. Very, very intense. But... Oh my God, nail biting. For the whole thing, my heart was in my mouth. I literally thought I was going to die. I'm always impressed by something I can't do, and I couldn't do that. It was like Lara, I was like, <gasps> you know, at the end, it was a bit worrying because I was worried that you were going to get hurt. I'm feeling your pain. I know what it's like for something to go wrong on stage, but I loved you. As <laughs> nice about it was, I know you're a couple, and it was great you kept checking on each other as the performance progressed to make sure you were both okay. And I feel like relationships, you've got to check on the person, like, is this okay with you? And then you were like, all right, let's keep going. So that was good. <laughs> Judges, it's now time to lock in your votes. The judges' votes are now locked in. I'm offering you a cash deal of 1,000 euro to leave immediately. If you turn it down, it's all about the votes. Are you going to take the deal or are you going to take a chance? You'll take the chance. Let's reveal the results on the tower. George voted for you. There 
There you go, another one from Deirdre. Now you just need one more. I can't wait to see you again, guys. I really do think you've done a great job and it's going to get bigger and better. You learn by mistakes. That's how you get better. So next time you come on, just wow us. I, I'm happy for you guys. You have the skills and you deserve to be seen again. Let's hear it for Sean and Raphael, everybody. Thank you. Let's all go skating after this. Absolutely not. It's time to meet the next act. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Tell everyone your name and where you're from. My name is Martin McDonald and I'm from Dublin. <laughs> Who is here supporting you tonight? So my mom, my dad and my brother are over there. They're so very supportive. Put your hands together for Martin McDonald. Thank you. Good luck. Well, let's go straight to the judges. Aston, what do you think? Martin, man, your voice at the top end is so rich, so pure. I'm impressed. Thank you so much. Well, Martin, I'm not going to lie. When you were singing, you looked over this way. I thought my ovaries were going to melt. <laughs> I was like, holy guacamole. Wow. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry about that. George, did you feel the same? Nothing happened to my ovaries, obviously, but uh, <laughs> that you were very nervous, but you, you overcome it. Once you started singing, I'm very excited to see whether you'll take the money or, or stay. Martin, congratulations. I mean, you sang that beautifully. Well done. Thank you so much. And, Jedward, the fact that you came from Grafton Street to the big deal makes it better, because you can have a singer on stage, but the fact that you as a person radiates this good energy, it makes it even a, a big deal. Judges, it's time now to lock in your votes. You're going to need at least three S votes to make it through. You can take a chance on the votes or you can take some money and walk away from the competition for good. I'm offering you a cash deal of a thousand euro to leave immediately. Do you believe in your talent? I do. No, I do. I think uh, coming into this, I was, I was hoping to go for, for the long run. And, uh... Well, are you going to take the deal or are you going to take a chance? I am. Um... not going to take the deal. I'm going to take a chance. OK, so you're turning down the deal. OK, let's reveal the results on the tower. Yay. Austin voted for you. It's one. Is there a second? Yes, you got a second vote. OK, you need one more, one more to progress through to the semi-finals. Is it there? Oh. Five guesses. I, I literally lost words. Thank you so much. Martin McDonnell, everybody. Our final set of acts take their chances in the auditions. With only a few places left in the semi-finals, the competition has never been tougher. Join us then. Good night.